Hey guys, so this is the look that we are going for today. And um, <clears throat> I'm a little sick or under the weather. I feel better. I sound a lot worse than what I feel. So, yeah. Um, earlier this week, though, I was a mess. But, yeah. So, this is the look that we are going for. Um, dramatic eyes, dramatic lips. Thought I'd switch it up a bit. Um, in... Um, the tutorial I used some products and I didn't get a chance to show you like some dupes for them so for the purples like the purple up top and the purple right here if you don't have what I used you can use this purple and this purple for the lid color I used um, for the lid base I used a paint pad paint pad paint pot from MAC which is artifact if you don't have that you can use Rust from NYX. This is the Jumbo Stick and Rust. If and also my other lid color, or my other for my lid color, I use Pink Opal Pigment. But if you don't have that, you can use anything that kind of like a lighter purple. I think this purple would be pretty over it because I've done it before. This look before was shale. In a, it's a purple but not shale beautiful iris whatever and you can just substitute it for anything that has pink reflex in it or um, a really light pink eyeshadow or something like that so yeah if you want to see how I achieve this look then okay so for time's sake I've already applied um, all my bases I use max paint pot in soft ochre and then I went in with another base, <coughs> which is um, Artifact Paint Pot by MAC, but mine is just a sample that I got from a friend. And I just placed that on the lid up to the crease. So now what am I, what am I going to do? Hmm, I don't know. Now what I'm going to do is take this color right here from my Coastal Scents 28 Neutral Palette and I think I pointed to the wrong color did I? I'm taking this color sorry and I'm going to pick some up on a MAC 224 brush and I'm going to place this in my crease area Okay, now I'm going to take another um, color. I'm going to take Fig 1 from MAC. But if you have the um, Lust palette, the palette from Wet n Wild with the purples in it, the lighter purple, matte purple, will um, is a good duplicate for this. I would show it, but it's like in my makeup where I keep my makeup, my makeup storage, in my makeup, it's in my makeup storage, and same brush, I just wiped it off, um, and I don't feel like getting up to get it, I'm sorry, I'm being lazy, alright, so, and I'm just going to place this in the crease, but I'm going to slightly drag it all the way over, next, I'm going to take, um, shadowy lady and again if you have the um, lust palette you can use the dark purple from MAC and I'm going to take that on a 217 brush I'm just going to pick up some color I sound awful but I feel a lot better than I sound I'm just really con lots and lots of congestion I should say totally clogged up and place this on the outer corner of the eye. Okay. Now I'm going to take another color from MAC. And I guess I'm just going to use um, this elf brush. I'm going to take a pigment from MAC and it's called Pink Opal and it looks white 
but it kind of reflects um it reflects pink and it looks like this I'm trying to make sure I don't spill it I don't need a mess um and I'm going to use this elf um eyeshadow brush and a little fix plus and I'm going to I've already put some in a lid and so I'm going to pick some of that up tap off any excess and I got kind of a lot and I'm going to wet it with the fix plus and place this on the eyelid on top of where I put the artifact paint pot Okay, I'm going to do my other eye, add lashes, liner, and come back with complete Okay, look. so I'm back, and here are the eyes up close. And here is my entire face. For my lips, I use, um, I use like three different, four different things. First, I line my lips with NYX's Prune. I lined my lips and kind of blended it out and that's what that looks like <clears throat> and then I put max up the amp on top it's like a purpley pink <laughs> fumble and then I used um, I lined my lips again with max current which is like a deeper burgundy red which is right here and then on top of that I put max extra amps dazzle glass and I rarely use this thing but it's almost gone so I don't know if I'll be replacing it or not um don't get a lot of bang for your buck on that one for my um cheeks I used max flirt and tease which is a sheer tone blush and for my eyebrow highlight, I used um, my Coastal Scents 28 Neutral Palette, which is swiftly becoming my, one of my favorite palettes. I use these two colors right here. Um, so, oh, and under my eye, I just, for my waterline, I used Wet n Wild's Cream Liner in Black. If I was going somewhere, I would probably set it, but I'm just going to my mom's for a Sunday dinner. And then under, I went under my eye with Urban Decay's Rockstar, which is just a purple, a dark purple. And I smudged it with um, the dark purple, which ooh, ooh, is um, Shadowy Lady. So, yeah, that's it. Um, oh, and my lashes are wispies but I messed this one up but oh well and my top liner is Maybelline ultra liner in black okay so that's everything that I used um until the next time um I thank you all for watching and subscribing if you have peace